about me? I'm in front of other people oh, right now. Yeah, all those hey, guys. who's announcing this thing? Kane! <laughs> okay, guys. Calm down. Oh, grab your chicken curry and just come hang out with us. I'm going to vote something curry related because it's. A, I also had curry for lunch today for reals. I so. stopped at Champions Curry. Let's go. Hey, listening it. Once Michael joins, it's all gonna go to hell. And which digital circus character do you most identify with? Not who is your favorite, but who do you most identify with? Because we all know the favorite is the dog that shows up in episode two. So I don't know. I honestly kind of mostly identify with Kanger. <laughs> so I was like, if we do future episodes and you want me to like re-record anything, anything, mm -hmm. like tell me right now. And Goose was like, it's fine. You're fine. Yeah, <laughs> Everybody like, jumped on the train. Every single one of us were like, really? No. Like, you know what? How about we just redo all of them? Right? <laughs> all of it. I thought Kafma was the main character because it seemed oh. like everybody was talking about him. And I was like, this must be like the main guy and he's just not on the sides. Maybe they precast somebody, you know, like maybe they already knew who they wanted for Kofmo because everybody's talking about him. I don't see him. And then as we're recording episode one, Goose is like, oh yeah, Kofmo's like dead. He's not here. And I was like, <laughs> I was like, clearly I don't know what's going on. I the materials ahead of time for protective reasons. You know, we come in and we are the wee kindergarten babs going, hello. I know absolutely nothing about everything, and I need help. And we also have my favorite digital circus character, <laughs> Subaru Natsuki. But uh, any, even when I was allowed to have adult drinks, um, I'm not saying anymore for my father's sake. Um, I would choose not to have wine at the New Year's Eve parties. I would have the sparkling fruit juices and go sit over at the kids' table because I thought it was the great tasting stuff ever. So. I'm just a big fan of that. And uh, for my birthday, I'll often treat myself, get like a six pack of sparkling juices and enjoy that. So that is my little oh, nice. Deluxe story. All right. On to at sign. the end of this stream, someone hasn't doodled Kinger with grape juice. I'm going to be heartbroken. I need to see it. Someone tag yeah. me on Twitter when it happens. Okay. It needs to be in like a fancy, bougie looking glass too. But yes. he has to do one of two things with, with it. In my fun. mind, he would consume it one of two ways. Either there's a little cork on the top of his piece that he takes out and he pours it in or he literally like opens the robe and pours it down which means one of two things either the robe wasn't purple it just got stained from all the grape juice <laughs> <laughs> or he pours it into the top of the hole and he's like well oh, that was great see y'all later and as he starts to walk <laughs> off you see just this trail of grape juice oh, no when the when the ghosts and Casper eat the food and it just falls out the bottom, there's like a slug-like trail of purple grape juice on the floor being dragged by his robe like a Swiffer wipe. Also could see Kinger, after he pours the grape juice into the top of his head, pulling a ridiculously long silly straw out and just sticking it up there and then drinking it. <laughs> Mm -hmm. He goes, he does all the extra steps just to drink it normally. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I just realized, though, how does Kinger drink? He doesn't have a mouth. How does he Don't eat? It. Don't question it. <laughs> how? Don't question how? it. Episode three. Spoilers. Shut up. <laughs> oh my God. You can't, you can't keep saying stuff like that because people in the chat are like, there's a dog in episode two. He's joking. <laughs> <laughs> you, I, I can't pick a line from episode one because you ruined it with what you did for a meme when Pomni and you are at the bank and you're like, uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's it's the way that you say keep up at the end. You're just like, we're adventuring, Pomni. Keep up. Like, it was just, it was <laughs> the way. Keep up is so good for no <laughs> reason. Of being uplifting and and supportive but also just the right amount of aggressive of like you'll be next if you don't so good and i literally did the night before i left for california and the entire time i'm just on the like in the airport i'm just seeing this thing blowing up i get on the plane i can't use wi-fi five hours later it's exploded into the most popular thing i've ever shared on twitter and i'm just like <laughs> um, I think my favorite as my character was there are so many times where I'm like making all of these plans and then it turns out I can just do one thing and it will take care of it. And in my brain, I go, oh, <laughs> like, <laughs> <is that> easy? <laughs> that I come up with and with Kinger, it's just can you say by name? But as Kinger, Marissa, 
That's it. <laughs> this is this is the way when my friends are always talking crap about me or when they give an insult that they're obviously joking about. I am the kind of person that would look at them endearingly and go, thank you. <laughs> Any scene where she's yelling at Jax, but my favorite line is, I mean, it's it was the line that I auditioned with and I think about it. Anytime someone gets upset, I say it in my head, everything's going to be okay, new stuff. I say Aww. it 24-7, all the time. Aww. I I definitely said it over Christmas, for sure. And my sister looked at me and went, okay, put it away. <laughs> Fair. For you to choose from, if you would like to choose, you can have black, you can have silver, you can have gold, or you can have white. Just Let me know. Right. You can have brown, you can have blue, you can have white. <laughs> you're my first. Like it. Like the, you didn't even do anything, but be Kane and be in tears. You didn't even do anything! <laughs> yeah! I want to write something funny that I said in the video that's coming out tomorrow, so you get a little sneak peek. Ooh. And the line I'm thinking is, I think hamburgers work well with fries! <laughs> All right, Did I got one for Did you get that from my Insta collection? <laughs> this... All I was going to say is someone pointed out the Spamton plushie, and I was going to say, don't you want to be a big shot? <laughs> one of my favorite deliveries of his as well is, boy, we're not very good at this, are we? <laughs> <laughs> Me during any D&D &D session. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Amazing. Roma wanted me to draw a little kinger head, and there we go. Ah, oh boy. It's so good! And I noticed that he, his eyes were looking towards his fingers, so it, you can't see it on this camera, but he's saying, Whoa, nice hands. <laughs> <laughs> Just say Damn! They're like, why won't you say you're six feet? Because I'm not. Because you're not, because you're 5'11". I'm five There's nothing wrong with being 5'11". In the five foot squad, I am I'm a key. wide boy. I'm 5'7". I'm the shortest one here, somehow? Sweet little gangle. Oh, Sweet come one. on. <laughs> Is Kinger good at chess? I think Kinger could be great at chess, but he looks at the board, and then he looks at the piece that's supposed to represent him, and he has kind of like that out-of-body experience where he's just staring at it for an inordinately long amount of time. This one is kind of special to me because I'm sure we have prints of our characters and we may have prints of ourselves in our photos. But how often do you have a print of yourself as a character? Oh, Alex, did you have something you wanted to say? Uh, no, I'm just uh, typing out my official statement about Momocon. <laughs> so, star. Man, I feel like we're on the precipice of getting into theories about the show because, like, I think Gangle's the strongest character. <laughs> I, I, think, I think they are. I seriously think if there's going to be any major twist where like some character needs a, an unknown or subdued power, that Gangle is going to be the one that completely upends everyone's expectations. And oh yeah, I believe that a hundred percent. I cannot wait for Gangle to just lose it. I also can't wait for Gangle to go Ultra Instinct. It'll be really cool. Yes, <laughs> you're an artist, but you use your vocal cords. You get me. You understand. Thank you for saying I sound beautiful, Alex. You sound... <laughs> <laughs> it always comes back to this guy. We always gotta come back to go to this place. I feel like it's okay because actually my dad's from New York, so like, it's fine. Please remember when you feel sad or frightened. Always remember times when you feel happy. When day is dark, always remember happy day. Oh my god, brilliant. Poetry so I'm gonna write, when, <laughs> when day is dark, always remember happy oh, day. Remember happy day. <laughs> Truly, Truly a quote. Uh, I have one here. I have Mir. For us, it says, what is one of your favorite movies that you've seen? My favorite movie of all time is Little Shop of Horrors. The mm -hmm. 80s yeah. version. Over again. Um, I was like, what if Kinger got abstracted? So here is... Oh, no. Here oh, no. is Ponner. Uh, 
He's he's been taken by the shadows. He's got red pupils, and when I went to go blow on it to dry it, one of them exploded and started bleeding. So <laughs> he's just got a bleeding <laughs> eye because Ponder baby. Not the realistic blood eye, dude. Right, right. So uh, there you go. The there's, blood. there's your kinger lore. There's Hyper Ponder. realistic blood. Emo kinger, right? Love it. My my kinger romance. I'm not okay. <laughs> Wake me up inside. <laughs> Amazing. Apologies for my mm, just great, great Kinger impression there. I was you... asking if Kane could sing All Star. Oh my God. Please do. I... <laughs> Are you sure? Right now. <clears throat> um, body once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. She was looking kind of dumb with her finger and her thumb in the shape of an L on her forehead. <laughs> I mean, but how I far is it going to go? Performance from our ringleader. Emo gangle, yeah. Crawling in my <laughs> yes, yes, yes. This is the problem. You can't, you can't yeah, sing well. You can't do this. Well, you can't do this to me. It's perfect, Marissa. I want a full cover, and I want it on my desk by tomorrow. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! If I get an order for an inspirational one, I usually sit on it for like three, four days, and like think about it so hard. It's super easy. When sad, remember Hap Day. Uh, yes. All right. <laughs> Wish I knew. I wish we could tell you. We're okay. all waiting for it with bated breath. Me to Gooseworks. What is happening in her head? Ooh, it's at I least wish seven. I, knew. I don't know. So since I don't know who's speaking to me, I had Kinger say, Oh, hello, mysterious voice. I'm a little less lonely now that I know you're here. I hope you also don't feel lonely. You're a good friend. <laughs> oh. When a bird spreads its wings to try and be more intimidating. <laughs> it's, like, oh, it's a papist! <laughs> I always knew they'd find me someday. Run for it, Marty! Ooh. <laughs> oh, so now, the, the video of the little kid that sticks with me is that, that little German boy who goes, Yippee! <laughs> I love that kid. That kid's my hero. I mean... Uh, my favorite, my favorite little kid on YouTube has always has always been. I like turtles. Go ahead, Amanda. He's not a little kid anymore. I forget what age I was, but that age where you think you're hilarious and you like you understand the concept of jokes and you're just so eager to make them. This is a real joke that I told. Tapper, what is the difference between a duck? One leg is both the same. That's the joke. John, John, you hurt me. You hurt me up here, and you hurt me in here. And I don't know what's happening. I'm tired the morning of a school field trip that I tried to cook six different bowls of oatmeal without ever putting water or milk in the grains. So, I, uh, you know the dinosaur egg oatmeal? I managed to set one of those eggs on fire. No! How? 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 It was it, it was in the microwave for so long that the dry egg burst into flame and Sean, the oatmeal melted the bottom of the bowl out. <laughs> Sean, how long? Sean, what was the number that you punched in? Five minutes. No, five minutes. I when the first one, when the first two came out torched, I was like, I must have done something wrong. Maybe I didn't put it in for long enough. How old were you? We too young. <laughs> Your favorite character is Ragatha. Thank you. Thank you. I apologize. That was my dog who just woke up from his five hour nap. Oh, I thought it was a cat. Can ever bite his eyes? Oh. You might find that out oh. tomorrow. Oh, I hate that mental image. Oh, man. You hurt me up here. You hurt me. You hurt me. <laughs> I'm, I'm, stealing, I'm, I'm stealing that from you, Amanda. I'm crediting you with that, but I'm stealing it from you. You're welcome. What can I say? I'm just, I'm very funny. I'm very um, funny. someone. Okay. Yes. There's so many of you too. Kinger can't say, 
You like jazz? <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. I'm really glad you're here, new stuff. Aww. Hi, Scoot. I really appreciate that you asked for me. It's so sad. I love Gangle. I could listen to you do Gangle all day.